Hey guys, what's up for another video? Today we are going to be drawing a cocker spaniel. Okay, like I promised in the contest, or we were going to be drawing a cocker spaniel today. And uh, over the over the contest, we got a new subscriber. It's cool. They're called HDSHF, um, <laughs> weird choice of name, but they have got us up to eight subscribers. And guys, I've got a ten subscriber special ready. So please be sure to subscribe and hit that like button so then I know you like my content and I can change it if you don't like it and and I can release that new subscriber special like pretty soon okay so let's get straight into drawing the cocker spaniel okay so as always you want to start off with the eyes Okay, it's somewhere over here. Okay, somewhere over here, you just want to do a nice round circle. Okay, then you want to draw that line like that. Then you want to draw a big circle in a small circle just like that do the lines here and then shade the eye in so guys my sharpie is actually running out soon so I'm gonna have to replace it with a new pen okay so just be aware of that when I've switched pens. Okay, then you want to do the second die just over here. Nice and round. You want to draw the line, big circle small circle okay okay so now we have done the eyes okay and i just want to um give you a little bit of information today i was just I'm trying to repeat the husky and I managed to put a collar on it okay so if you like that um if you like that then I'll be sure to like show you maybe a little bit how to do the collar or I could just show you right now so you just want to complete that little bit there then you want to come out just like so do the line do the little doggy bone color it in and it's pretty much e it's that, that easy okay so if you like it well you might as well do one of the features of this video like the video okay and I'll know to make sure to be carrying on these kind of stuff okay so back on to the nose so the nose you want to go to somewhere to the middle like here you want to do that then you want to make it curve down and for the cocker spaniel like we're gonna be giving it like a sad kind of puppy dog eyes um expression okay so you want to just come down like that then you want to just do it like that. Sad, those sad puppy dog eyes. And then you want to 
come a little bit up here and then you just want to do a little line like so okay to make it even more cuter okay and now we're going to be moving on to the head okay so i've changed pen just now okay so now we're gonna start to draw the head okay so here um here you want to draw a little bit up on this like the middle of the eye you want to come out and then just come up and then you want to do a little dip like that and then you want to like squiggle your way down here then here you want to squiggle for the nice big ears okay and then we're gonna leave it there okay because we've got the f they've got the head so then it looks like it looks like the ears are like over the head like that and it gives it a little effect okay so then to repeat the same over here okay and that's that Okay, then you want to get it just like the other one, just like that and then that. Go a little bit more down and then you want to curve it up like that. Okay, there we go. And you've drawn the ears now. So now we're going to get to the actual head. So for the head, you want to start somewhere like here. And you just want to come down just like that. Just like that. Okay, repeat the same on the other side. Okay, now you've drawn the head and it's looking looking like pretty good now. Okay, it's going to be quite bigger than the other ones, like about that big, pretty big than the other ones, but, um, yeah, it's going to look, the result is going to be just as good as the other ones in the end. Okay, so let's get to the body. Okay, so you want to come somewhere in the ear, do you want to do a little line like that? curve it like that then you just want to leave it there okay and now that line you want to continue it and bring it down here you and then it, now we're starting to draw the legs Okay, repeat the same on the other side, but this time we're just going to do that. Do that. Now you 
want to bring it down like that and then you've and then you've drawn the foot and you want to carve that down like that and out here for the foot you just want to do that and then close it off like that and then after that you want to get that and then you want to go, go here repeat the same on the other side do that and then you want to curve that down to close it off like that do the two little marks So you want to curve it down like that and then finish it off like that. And you want to do that, you want to curve it and connect it there just like so. Then repeat the same on the other side. And there you go. There you go and that's that done. And then after that, you just want to draw the tail like that. And if you want to give it a little bit of detail here, you can just like do that. If you're not comfortable with the zigzagging, just don't need to do it but it does give it a lot of detail okay okay so yet again with our previous drawings we are going to be drawing the colors on this cute cocker spaniel okay so here you just want to do it like that then do that and that's going to be brown the only colors you're going to need is blue like sky blue brown and yellow and red okay so you've once you've done that you want to also go here so like this bit you want to curve it up like that right past the eye and then then go up and then like glide off to the right okay then you want to do the same here right past the eye and you want to glide off to the left Okay, there we go, and that's that done. Okay, now we want to do the leg parts. Okay, so here, you want, you want to do that. Then do this. Okay, there we go. Then here by the ear, you just want to dip down do a little bit of zigzagging then curve like that here you want to do the same and that's all the colors you need to do so back to the pen um, if you want to draw the the color you just want to make a, you want to finish this and close it off and after that you want to you want to get your pen and then just curve in making the collar okay then you want to draw a little line down and just like with our collared husky you want to draw a little doggy bone 
right there. Okay. Okay. So that's that done. No. That's our collar. Okay, and now I'm going to be right back after the finished coloured process. Okay, so that is the finished result. If you like this and you manage to draw this as well, please leave a like, subscribe as always, and I'll see you in my next video. Okay, goodbye.